All right, we are here at Trailhead. We are going to take Jiffy Pop up on a backpacking trip uh, to 10 Mile Campground. And uh, buddy over here. Damn, Brian. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah, that's still it, right? Okay, Joey Cheeks. And that's Jiffy Pop. All right, about to start the uh, the hike. Pack is heavy today, feeling it. All right. We're coming up to the Connecticut sign, although this is like the second one. There's one um, before that trailhead, but uh, this is where it's flat for a while before we go up 10 Mile Hill. That's not too bad, it's about 600 feet. Over a mile and a half. Really pretty hike, especially during the winter. All right. We are on the trail. As Underdog says, real time AT. All right, we're starting the climb. It's gonna climb for like a half a mile. Half a mile? Yeah. <laughs> Feeling it. Feel the burn. Maybe. Which one? Oh yeah. Every single time. Every time I've been there, every time we've been there. Saying he was tired and this was a little tough, but <laughs> he's long gone. So yeah, me and Joey Cheeks are hanging back here, taking our time. Hello. Hi. <laughs> I'm such a nerd, I know. All right, up here on 10 Mile Hill, made it to the top. That's Wingdale, New York over there. We're at about a thousand feet, uh, about halfway through the hike. Mile Hill sign, thousand feet. Not too bad, it was about a 600 foot climb, I think. I was just visiting the office. Uh, lens was all foggy from being in my pocket. Oh uh, yeah, Look, uh, this is about a, I don't know, half mile out and back from the AT, maybe a little bit more, um, but it's worth it. Um, we just met the guy from the Connecticut Forest and Park Association who maintains it with his son. Uh, all these trails, they were actually building a new loop, which is really cool. I love new trails. And uh, this view is worth the climb back up. And I just don't come down here often enough, so I'm glad that Chili Cheeks made us come down. I'll show you in a second. I was glad I had micro spikes in the winter because it was... Quite the 100 foot cliff right here. Yeah. I almost tripped. Our campsite is right down there. Yeah. But we got to go back up and back down. Working on the chair. You want to do a little? Okay. So just get I've done it before. Right. I'm going to roll it though. Atta boy. Just make sure that saw doesn't yeah, yeah, fly yeah. out and cut you, okay? Pinch oh god, it's kind of stuck. Yeah, that's that's why they use wedges. Oh, wait, it's stuck. Hold on, let me help. It's fun though. Cutting off their head. Oh, it's dead here. There we go. Go slow, because when that comes through, it's going to go right to your leg. Mm -hmm. Is that video or picture? Video. Perfect. 
Nice. Hey, hold this saw up oh, and let's okay. do a picture. All right. Hang on. Let me do. Down 10 Mile Hill, feeling it in the knees, but there's some good switchbacks. We'll be at the campsite in about 20 minutes or less. All right, so yeah, see so how steep that is? The thing is, like, it looks much deeper when it's going up than when it's going down. You know? Oh, definitely. Like, look at these beautiful stairs that our chapter built. It looks like a flat plane when it's going down. Like, it looks like flat. When I looked up, I was like, wow, I was down that. Yeah, look up. It's that's a good size hill you I came down. down yeah. And you went up it the other way. Yeah, sure. Mile River over there, it's pretty low. Uh it runs into the Hoostonic up here by the campsite. So cool. Yeah, I'm just getting a for my video. And then it can, it joins the Houstonic up here under the Ned Anderson Bridge. Kind of just like under here? Yep, under me. You can put the date and then say whatever you want. All right, we're here at the shelter. Uh, there's a section hiker doing all the Connecticut and that group that we saw back at the parking lot just filled up the water, the pump, sign in the register. I'm going to go down to the campsite and set up our stuff there and uh, get to the business of camping. I gotta check the bear box too. Right here usually. Okay, we do have a fire ring to clear here. So you can help me with that. Oh, we have two of them. Stoves only, no fires. Fire, fire. Thanks people. Sadly, you're probably never gonna Oh, I can't really be seen. Anyway. All right, there we have uh, Chili Cheeks and Thumbs Up, newly dubbed. Uh, this is our campsite here down by the river oh, yes. and the other bear box and the other privy and uh, Jiffy Pop is over here and we're going to make some some mountain house and some chili mac and some Jiffy Pop and uh, some s'mores and we'll check out the river in the morning. All right Jiffy Pop what do you think about the uh, chili mac with beef um, mountain house? It's better than most meals I have. <laughs> We'll be fine. All right, so uh, Chili Cheeks here is uh, heading out for the evening. Going. And uh, Thumbs Up, who we have newly dubbed, is going to lock yeah. her out. <laughs> and then um, we are going to do some Jiffy Pop with Jiffy Pop in there and some s'mores. All right, you can't hike with Jiffy Pop without doing Jiffy Pop. Let's see how it works on the stove. Stay tuned. It's alive! Alive! We call it Frankenpop. Here we go. Here we go. Wait, actually, can I? You can do it for your story. Right? Yeah. I'm not sure we're gonna get it much bigger because the hole blew open, so the... Yeah, so <coughs> it burned a little because uh, there was a little hole <coughs> that opened. So we're gonna have uh, whatever's not burned and then make some s'mores, because that's easier not to mess up. All right, we're gonna do better than we did with that's the... Uh... Wow. Well, yeah, we just gotta catch it on fire. But the, real, the best way is to not catch a fire, but no one does that well. So Oh. oh. Mm. Yeah? Mm-hmm. You approve? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Nice. There he is, you see him? Oh, he's over there. So I don't think we can see anything on video. I've got a really nice starry sky. Yeah. But um one planet over here. We're on the, the Ned Anderson Bridge here and there's tons of stars and I just don't know if the video will pick any of it up. Um so we'll see. A little crayfish. Oh really? Yeah. We're here by uh the Ten Mile and Houstonic River. That's the Ned Anderson Bridge. It's about seven AM. We're looking for the blue herring gym. And I just saw him fly up river, but I don't see him now that we're here. But we do have this friend. What's up? Uh, let's just uh all right, Jiffy Pop is mm. dipping his dark chocolate really good. granola bar into the coffee. It's all that's melting now. <laughs> that sounds like a little wind right there. Yeah, that's a good idea. Ned Anderson and Ten Mile River there. I was hoping to see the heron, but I think he's moved on. He usually sits in that rock right over there. But we were up there at the overlook yesterday where we were looking down the river. And uh, we got about a mile and a quarter to the car which we dropped yesterday. Uh, nice morning. All right, Jiffy Pop, you ready to hit the trail again? Yep. Good morning, America. All right, getting back on the trail. Mm -hmm. Headed out. Thumbs up and Jiffy Pop. Get her Yeah, I just wanted to get the river down there. M3 four-door sedan with a five-speed. No, E36, yeah.